All right, we're going to be starting our unit on adaptations, animals and plant adaptations. Today, we are going to be starting our notes on what are adaptations. You have this. I've already colored it, taking the time beforehand to color, and you can do that if you want. We are going to fold it just like this. I'm going to zoom out just a tad. You're going to take the top left corner and fold it until it touches, just touches the bottom. And then you're going to take this corner and we're going to fold it like that. So we're going to be talking about the structures and functions, kinds of adaptations. So here are our notes to begin with. A structure is a body part. And a function is its job. A structure is a body part or an organization of tissue or body parts on an organism. So a structure is a body part. It is something that is created that is an adaptation. Now the next thing over here are the functions which is the way something works or what it can do. What is its job? And an environment is the living and non-living things living around an organism. So we have the functions, ways wo something works or what it can do, the structures, which is a body part, tissue, or uh, body parts on an organism, and we have an environment, which is the living and non-living things around an organism. So pause that, finish the notes, and come on back. Okay. All right. A niche is a role an organism plays in its environment. What is its job? And then we also need to know a habitat is a place where an organism lives. We're going to be learning a lot about habitats. And now what is an adaptation? An adaptation is a characteristic that helps a plant or animal to survive. Aquatic is in water. And a prairie is like a grassland or plains. Okay. Now we're going to talk about some examples. Let's talk about the beaver. The beaver lives in a river habitat. It has a tail that is a structure. Now, what does a tail do? Uh, one of the uh, functions of a beaver's tail is to help with swimming. It's kind of like a rudder to help it swim. Another one is an alligator. Now, we know alligators live in swamps, bogs, marshland, and wetlands, and any pond in Florida. They have scales. So what is the purpose of the scales? To protect their body. They also have other functions, but that's one. How about an eagle? An eagle lives on a prairie. They have eyes that are very strong. What is its function? To help locate prey. And then the last one is a flounder, which is a type of fish. 
So they live in the ocean. They have two eyes on one side of its body. Now, what is the purpose of that? So it can hide. And blend in. That way it could see. So those are our adaptation notes.